Hi friends, Miss Julie here from the Hamilton East Public Library and welcome to Fairy Tale STEM. Today we're going to talk about the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. And if you don't know this story, you can hop on over to Bookflix at the link below to listen to Goldilocks and the Three Bears by James Marshall. Now Goldilocks apparently has some behavior problems because she just walks right into a stranger's home. She ate the bear's food, slept in the bear's bed, and even broke baby bear's chair. Not cool, Goldie. We're going to help Goldilocks make things right with the bear family. Let's design a strong new chair for baby bear as a way for Goldilocks to say she's sorry. Make sure that the chair has four strong legs, a back, and is about 12 inches tall. All right, so the materials that you might need for this project are newspaper and like a cereal box or something similar to it, foam sheets or construction paper, sticks, and these can be craft sticks or stir sticks, pipe cleaners, straws, tape, rubber bands, and scissors. So when you're all finished with your chair, you need to make sure that it will hold the load of a baby bear. Load is the amount of weight that the chair can hold. So you can try setting a doll or maybe a stuffed animal on it like this. And if you don't have those things, you can set maybe a water bottle on it, something like that. So how did you do? If your design didn't quite work, that's okay. Step back, take a look at it, make your changes, and then try it again. We'd love to see how you did. Have a grown up take a picture and share it with us on our social media pages Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram, hashtag HamiltonEastPL.